All right, hi there, my name's Jack Lark and I'm the producer and one of the co-directors of The Old Man and the Old Moon. Um, here we are today at the Lena Hotel where we've just had our first rehearsal, first read through with the cast. It's a pretty exciting time, I must say. Um, but welcome, I want to start a series of video production vlogs where we take you behind the scenes of how we're just putting this entirely Tasmanian production together of The Old Man and the Old Moon. So come join us over the next few weeks. Follow the song from the storm. How are we feeling, Ollie? Powerful. Yes. Oh. I'm loving this. It's so good. Follow the song from the storm. Hi everyone, I'm Finn and I'm one of the co-directors and the choreographer for The Old Man and the Old Moon. Well, I thought that I was in love with this show before we'd cast it, because um, Jack and I have been looking at it for a couple of years now and we you know, knew the music, and we knew the show and I thought that I loved it the most that I could love it. And then we found this cast of nine mm. that just happened to be the most brilliant, um, thoughtful, kind humans in Hobart and already they have started to bring it to life in this whole new way that I couldn't possibly imagine and that to me is so exciting. Finn and I are here just uh, having a little meeting before we meet with the creatives just to uh, get some stuff together for Mel, our set designer. Finn's getting his arts and crafts so. <laughs> Oh, sorry James. On that. Uh, I'm sorry? Someone just... <laughs> oh, <my God>. <laughs> <laughs> Shy yes. musical theatre people. Hey. Hey. Hi, I'm Mila and I'm the assistant director and the assistant stage manager. The show is really important to me, kind of on a personal level, because um, in my job I work with people who don't get the same opportunities or the same advantages as everyone. And so it's so important, I think, to have a show that's successful to everyone. All right. Hi, everybody. We are at uh, mine and Finn's house with Moz, the musical director, and we're just going over the script and uh, preparing for our first rehearsal that happens in a week's time. So come on in. How are you doing, boys? Yeah, good job. That, that, that she loves him more than she ever has as well. You know? and I, I forgot to say this before, but that moment of where he gets home and it's like this whole... He, like it, 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 it's almost like this serious guilt or something. It's like, oh, you know, like you know, now I realise. No, we we'll go at the end of the script and then we can have a little bit of a chat about. I think the old man's character arc. Yeah, it could be that, or it could be there's a ladder here and sort of like coming up over the top of this section somewhere. But I'll leave that up to you. To this do. is my first time producing, and I think it's uh, like the perfect show for me. When Finn and I first stumbled across the show like two years ago, we were. Like, it's one of those, like, like, like the moon pulling us, <laughs> like the tides. Totally. We were just drawn to it immediately. What Pigpen did in New York with the show and how they created it was phenomenal. We, we were just, we fell in love immediately. It's charming, the music is beautiful. Um, the fact that the cast are playing it live on stage as well is so special. I, I, I think, I think it is the perfect show for Hobart right now. Just coming out of COVID especially, mm. We need shows, we need live experiences that bring people together and that's happening on stage and off. So uh, I, I'm very lucky to be working on this show. I, I'm, I, I feel like I should be stressed. <laughs> yeah. And that makes me stressed that I'm not stressed. Yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah. Totally you know what I mean? Yeah. Page one. Have you seen the moon tonight? <laughs> <laughs> 